So this is the I'm finally shooting the intro of this video. If you've noticed, I have traveled from all the way from Nairobi to home, uh, but I didn't vlog in the middle because I was tired and exhausted. And also, if you watched my last video, I talked about um, burning out. I had shot very many videos and I was just exhausted. So today is my graduation party at home when is today today is on sunday and i traveled on tuesday actually this is literally how many days later this is literally three to four days later since i got home i've been at home for a few days now so we decided to put the graduation party on sunday because my aunties wanted to attend and they got they have jobs to do so they're only free on sunday so we felt on sunday is the best Day. so i'm still so excited for my graduation um congratulations to me i am you know very very happy my cousins are actually here it's on a sunday it's around 11 a.m uh, of course people had to go to church first of all before they come so a few updates i already picked the cake yesterday my graduation cake i'll show you guys uh, the clip of the cake right here but i'll also show you guys how the cake looks like the cake is so amazing so the person who made the cake for me is called valex so valex i used to go to high school we were in the same high school together and I actually saw her post on her facebook page that she makes the cake i didn't initially knew she was baking so i saw on her facebook and i decided to reach out to her and also the fact that she lives around um on on your way to eldoret yeah on, on your way to eldoret from my home to eldoret roughly 50 minutes to one hour or less depending on the speed you're using so yeah so she lives a few minutes from my home so i decided to order from her because there was no way i would order from the place i'm used to ordering in nairobi and then carry the cake all the way it's impossible by the time i get here the cake will be smashed probably it won't be still fresh and all that so i decided to order from her so she delivered yesterday and yeah so if you want to order cakes from her she does amazing amazing um designs birthdays weddings i have seen some amazing birthday cakes from her and i just wish she was in nairobi you know she's around eldoret so delivering to nairobi is impossible for her she doesn't deliver all the way she only delivers if you are around eldoret uh, or kapsabet because for me at home um my hometown is kapsabet so that's where i stay so she delivered and i went to pick i actually went to pick it at a nearest there's like a center around where my home is so i went to pick it there and it's just amazing it's so nice so today we'll do the testing i'll be cutting the cake with my family my mom is there my sister's my cousins, my aunties, they'll all be here. And also my grandmother. My grandmother is staying at our place because she's not feeling well. So we have to take care of her. Um, yeah, those are the few people who are able to attend. The rest of my aunties, uncles and other cousins, they're not able to attend because most of them are not at home. Some of them, um, they go to work even on Sunday and some are just not able to attend. So yeah. But they wished me the congratulations and it's just amazing thank you to all of you who wished me on my previous graduation vlog i really do appreciate so i have done my makeup so today is on a sunday and i was just helping out with the cooking and the cleaning before we um the guests come before the guests arrive so they'll be coming here from around 2 p.m around there also i removed my nails i know you guys have noticed <laughs> i actually removed them you know what happened one of the nail broke and it was painful let me tell you it was very painful i had to remove them i just had to there was no option and again typing you know for me i do 
online typing a lot that's my work i do online writing a lot so typing i had a project i had a very big project i was working on while still in nairobi just before i traveled i had a project to do and typing was just impossible it was close to impossible let me tell you i'd rather just do gel on my natural nails than do the long stick ones or if i do the stick ones i do shorter ones but for me i wanted the longer ones specifically for my graduation shoot but yeah i stayed with them for two weeks so to the two weeks that they survived congratulations to me actually that's the longest i have stayed with stick ones usually the first time i tried it it stayed for only one week and that was it so yeah so that's about me so i have done my makeup just something slight or something very simple and my hair is bad but just ignore this actually this is the third week i am having this hair so i'll probably remove them next week but i'll be at home for around two to three weeks around there before i travel back so yeah so let's celebrate the graduation together because there was no way i would fail to celebrate my graduation it's a milestone not everyone gets to see not everyone gets to experience so congratulations to me and also um we didn't get to celebrate the graduation with my parents back in nairobi so we decided to just do it at home so that everyone gets to attend because my aunties also wanted to come to nairobi but as i said there was limitation with covid they limited the number of people who allowed so it was impossible for everyone to travel to you know to come to ku so they just they felt bad but yeah life still had to happen so we are doing the graduation party today and my nephew is very excited you know for him he loves cakes and he has been asking me when are we cutting the cake from yesterday because it was delivered yesterday so we had it in the house from yesterday so he's so happy so all the kids are playing outside that's why it's very silent my mom is cooking so so yeah so let's see how the day will turn out tomorrow i'll also be going somewhere because um it's a celebration mode okay it's it's just celebrating celebrating and appreciating everything and myself so tomorrow i'll be taking myself out somewhere probably i'll go with my nephew or probably not i'll see but if i go with him you guys will probably see him so so yeah so that's just about the day nothing big or nothing unique We'll just be eating cutting cake yeah that's just it so yeah so let's celebrate and see how the day turns out so if you've not subscribed to my channel subscribe remember we are on the road to 30k like the video comment share two thousand years later do you want to say hi say hi hey guys <laughs> this is my cousin my and this baby boy actually took care of this boy after form 4 you can see he's very he's a grown up boy right now but he was so tiny are yeah, you ready to eat the cake yes what's your name Jaden mm. yeah so that's my cousin another cousin Roy Kuja come and say hi <laughs> this is my other cousin um how old are you 7 Seven. What's your name? Royden. So he's Royden. Jordan Royden. Hey, you guys are twins. So this is my cousin. Uh, he's a boy. People might think he's a girl. Let me, let you guys. You have to see him. <laughs> yeah. So this is my baby cousin. My auntie's baby boy. Another auntie. Yeah. Another auntie. My auntie is by there behind the camera. You'll see her in a few. Kelly, come and say hi. Here's Kelly. You guys know Kelly. He was watching. He was watching. Why do you look like that? You look sad. Kelly say hi. Hi. So my hi guys. Hi guys. This is Blossom B's son. He's a big boy. My one and only child. <laughs> you guys know Kelly? He was in the graduation vlog. My one and only child. <laughs> and Blossom B. <laughs> Subscribe to Blossom B. Subscribe channel. to my channel. Yeah. We are almost getting to 1500. So we are 10 10 people yeah. to go. Yeah. See you. So, Yeah. Bye Kelly. Because yeah. he is very impatient. He wants to eat cake. You want cake? Yes. I'll give you cake. Yeah. Here is my other cousin. Say hi. Hi. This is my cousin, my the, the child to my mom's brother. Uncle. Yeah, my uncle. So say hi. Hi. What's your name? 
Damia. Damian, yeah, he's also a boy. I have so many cousins who are boys. There's literally no girl here anyway. Yeah, so they're in attendance. This this boys just want to eat cake. They're very impatient. So you'll see my aunt, my mom, and my sister in a few. The next day. Oof, good morning, guys. I just woke up. So this is the next day from the party. I had like a small gathering. It was just like a small one. My aunties were there, my cousins were there, my sister, my mom. Yeah, the few of us. So I had a class yesterday night. You know, I'm celebrating, but I'm still struggling with working here and there. So I'm supposed to go to Eldoret town. I want to go have fun, you know, just relax, be grateful congratulate myself because i'm still celebrating so if you do not know or if you're not kenyan um my hometown is kapsabet town it's just like a small town in kenya but if you're not in kenya you wouldn't probably you wouldn't know but it's just a place in kenya so that's where i am right now so i'm just about to get ready i decided to do this intro before i leave because i know Living will be so hectic and it's just about to rain as well so um it would be impossible for me to do the intro out so um i'm going to be relaxing somewhere i haven't decided our place but my sister was suggesting a certain um my sister was suggesting a certain restaurant in ld so that's where i'm about mm -hmm. to go it's like a one hour drive so i have my grandma in the room she wants yeah i have her here she's not feeling so well so yeah, so I'm just about to take a shower. It's so cold. I'm telling you guys, my home place is so cold. I already caught a cold. Like, yo, I have like the worst cold right now. If I'm to meet any one of you, I'm very sure you wouldn't escape this. But um, I feel like I've had the best graduation time, ceremony, spending with my friends, family. It's been amazing. And um, I think it's finally a wrap. It's just a wrap. I already sent my gown yesterday because I am at home and I couldn't travel all the way from my hometown to Nairobi. It's about seven hours drive. So I had to just send it to my friend who was also returning his so that he can return it with mine because the deadline was yesterday. So I sent it on Wednesday and yeah, he actually returned it for me. So I just want to take myself out somewhere, you know, congratulate myself for doing all this hard work yo it's not easy graduating is not easy no one should even tell you otherwise it's not easy so i want to go out somewhere relax um my hair is really bad by the way let me show you guys my hair is like really bad i don't know why it's this time around it has not like lasted so probably i'll remove it tomorrow or the next the day after because we'll be having some guests over to our place because my grandma is staying with us she's not feeling well so we're taking care of her so guests are actually coming to see her to know how she's faring on and all that so i wouldn't have time tomorrow and i think i'll undo it the next day so i'm i was still undecided of the place i wanted to go um there's this particular hotel my sister has told me it's at Rupa's Mall at LD, so I'd probably be going there. 
so if i meet any one of you guys i'll be excited because the last time i was there i didn't actually tell you guys i was going there so people dm'd me people dm'd me and they were like v you're so bad you should have said you're coming here and i was like i didn't realize i had so many people who watch me from eldoret you know it's crazy but eldoret is not really near my place or my hometown it's like one hour from here roughly let's say roughly 40 minutes 50 minutes far yeah around that time and i feel like i'm used to eldoret because my high school where my high school was you expected you just had to pass you know if you're coming from this side you just had to pass even if you're coming from nairobi you have to go to eldoret town take another matatu to my high school so my high school is not in eldoret per se but it's you just have to pass there you just have to go through there it's also like an hour or less from eldoret but i feel like i'm used to that town you know i have memories there i have been passing there for four good years and yeah it's just an amazing town so let's get ready probably i'll see you guys outside when i'm leaving so if you've not subscribed do subscribe as well like the video comment and also share let me see you guys when i'm already and glammed up so excited i'm really excited yeah kelly come say hi come and say hi here's my nephew come and say hi kelly here's my nephew he just woke up as well mm. i'll be leaving minanda okay Apple. Mm. You only want an apple only. Yes. I'll just buy you something. Yeah. Eh. Bye. 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 So yeah, so let's leave you guys. Let's get going because of time as well. So yeah, so I'll see you guys outside. So guys, we got here at around 1 p.m. Around 1 and this guy did not allow me to do anything apart from taking him to play his games and all that. So right now it's 4 p.m. We're just heading home. So yeah, we've had a good time. I haven't vlogged as much. But if you've not subscribed, please do subscribe, like, comment and share.